uchaguzi na lazima tu kuzungumzie safari ya pili. Wajua safari ya uchaguzi wa ni ya kwanza ya pili ni ya ujenzi sasa wa, ta, wa taifa na kuweza kutimisha sasa zile ndoto za mkenya kwa sababu ukiangalia hakuna manifesto ambayo ilikuwa mbaya uh, kwa waniaji uh, wengi wa vyama tofauti tofauti hapa nchini Kenya kwa hiyo ndoto itakayo ama kila ambacho kwa kimebakia ni kwamba viongozi unapokuwa wanakabidhiwa hivi uh, vyanzo vya usalama kwa kuapishwa basi lazima waanze kufanyia kazi manifesto maana zote manifesto bora manifesto za kuleta maisha bora manifesto za kumwezesha mwananchi kuwezesha uchumi kuimarisha biashara kuboresha miundo msingi na pia vile vile kuweza kubadilisha fikra ya mkenya kwamba lazima afanyiwe maana mambo mengi kwa nazungumziwa katika manifesto ni kumfanya mkenya kwamba ajue kuna wakati mwingine ana jukumu la ku ajituma yeye mwenyewe kwanza kabla kuweza kusubiri kiongozi aweze kuwajibika na kuweza kumbadilishia kila kitu. Kwa hiyo nafikiri uh, iwe takavyokuwa mirengo tofauti, vyama tofauti, manifesto zilikuwa nzuri. Lakini kama unavyojua miaka nenda miaka rudo tusema manifesto wa nzuri kama kitega tu e, cha zile kura. Lakini baadaye mkishatoa kura manifesto zinaekwa pembeni. Lakini kuna viongozi wengi walisema kwamba safari hii tutawaonesha uh, kwamba tunafanya kama tulivyoahidi katika manifesto zetu. And it should be a big responsibility on Kenyans to really ensure that. I mean, time must come to an end. When people say, I don't care about politics, um, I don't care who is elected, fine. You may not be as passionate, but I think every Kenyan has that responsibility to play their role, to ensure that um, the leaders that you put in office, whether yours won or didn't, you have a responsibility to really follow what they are doing, to be active as a citizen, because we gave ourselves a constitution not many years ago, and I wish Bobby could speak to this. And we agreed that we would uh, subject ourselves to public participation. So indeed, public participation you must have uh, to look also for uh, that space that you can speak and uh, ensure that uh, the things that you want done are actually done by the leaders that you've elected because that's the responsibility they carry. True, true. Um, and, and I mean, we're just getting off. Uh, <laughs> public participation and that's uh, choosing our leaders uh, so we've done that um, and now uh, our work continues in holding them accountable and accountable uh, uh, as per the promises uh, they made uh, we know that uh, promises are uh, you know it's, it's a Cuomo uh, the former uh, New York governor who said that uh, during campaign uh, promises are given in poetry but uh, once the leader is uh, elected and takes the reins of power, uh, he or she uh, does, uh, you know, rule in, in prose. So now the poetry is over. Now the real work starts. Uh, and uh, the fortunate thing is that uh, we have the, the, the promises of these leaders and their parties and their uh, coalitions. Um, and, and we can hold them accountable. And, uh, you know, uh, as you said, uh, public participation is one of uh, the, the national values and the principles of governance. And so it is expected that uh, after uh, this very critical uh, event, uh, because you have to remember that elections are, are an event, mm -hmm. uh, our work does not end here as, as, as citizens of Kenya. We must continue you know, pushing and prodding, um, uh, cooperating also uh, in a very, very, very um, uh, constructive way. Uh, so that uh, at the end of the day, uh, whoever becomes uh, the president of this country uh, becomes the president of all Kenyans, uh, regardless of uh, whether you voted uh, for, 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 for him or not. Uh, and uh, I think and, and hope that uh, whoever is uh, pronounced uh, as a winner uh, by Chairperson uh, Wafula Chabukati, uh, that will be the, the first message uh, that, uh, you know, now I become uh, the, the, the chief servant, actually, mm -hmm. of uh, all Kenyans. Um, and. Uh, uh, will be ready to be held accountable uh, from uh, the day uh, he is sworn in mm -hmm. uh, uh, for the next uh, five years. Right. Yeah. Yeah. right. And I'm advised that we need to cross back to the bombers of Kenya to have a feel of the mood uh, there, because I'm sure Kenyans want to follow and listen to what's going on there so that as we await the arrival of the chairman of the IBC commission, as well as um, the two presidential candidates, the final ones, getting into the auditorium. Let's listen to the proceedings there.
shukrani kwa Mungu kwa nchi yetu Kenya nchi ya urithi wetu Bwana Kenya wote tudumishe amani Kenya Yeah,